Hello folks, today I'm going to be reviewing T-Sun in Anchor in Apple Charger. So I wanted to see which charger works best. Mine died, so I ordered the T-Sun. Here's what it came in the Amazon package. It's really kind of poorly packed on the outside. It's just a plastic bag. So this is the tower right here, and I'm going to unbox the tower. It came in this box. It's nicely packaged in the box, just the packaging outside wasn't that good. So going inside, pull the product out, and you know it does come with the instructions over here, a little instruction that gives you what to do, how to go about things. And so when you pull it out, I mean it's not a bad looking unit, it looks pretty nice, it saves a lot of space because it doesn't sit flat. This is more of a tower, just stand straight. So this, you know, unwrap it. I did test this, so it comes with the two buttons on the top, one controls your USB ports. So you can turn those on and off if you're not using it, save some power. Uh, I think they call it energy monkeys, so it saves you some power if you just turn it off, it doesn't drain. And there's another button on there which controls all of these outlets over here. And basically that way you can control your outlets if you're not using it. Instead of unplugging, you can just shut it off. So it's not a really, you know, it's not a bad unit. It works pretty nicely. For my purpose as far as the outlet goes the thing i'm really disappointed about so usb port so looking at the board over here i had three different uh test equipment so for one percent charge it took me four minutes on this tson brand in order to get the full you know just one percent charge took me four minutes looking at the anchor you know one percent just took one minute i mean that is pretty fast right there so i would recommend that product over this one any day and I tested it against just a regular Apple that comes with it because I am curious. I mean, how long does the Apple take? So one minute, it takes about 1.58 seconds to charge up. So almost two minutes for 1% of power. So this is just the Apple charger that I tested. Just wanted to kind of put that into perspective. And this is the other charger that I got, the Anchor charger. It does come with a button, but button only controls the ports, USBs. It doesn't control the outlet. So outlet is always on on this particular system. But as far as if you're just going to work with the USB as your primary directive, I would definitely recommend the Anchor brand over the t brand. So it's, it's a nice looking unit, it works, but if you're relying on the USB chargers itself, it's not worth it. So the way it goes, it takes 4 minutes for 1%, and then we have 2, two minutes for 1% on the Apple, and then the Anchor comes in, and it, this guy only takes about 1 minute to get 1%. Definitely recommend it here. So folks, that was my quick review. I just wanted to let you know, you know, how the system works and what kind of buttons they have on each one of them. So, you know, if you like the video, you know, give me a thumbs up, subscribe. I'll do more reviews later on, just kind of starting out on the YouTube. So thanks. Thanks a lot. I appreciate you guys watching it.